পাঞ্জাবের বিরুদ্ধে অ্যাও ম্যাচ খেলতে যাওয়ার আগে প্রি ম্যাচ প্রেস কনফারেন্স সেরে ফেললো ইমা আমি ইস্ট বেঙ্গল এইদিন প্রেস কনফারেন্সে উপস্থিত হয়েছিলেন হেড কোচ কার্লেস কোয়াদ্রাত এবং দলে সদ্য সুযোগ পাওয়া তরুণ ফুটবলার মোহিতোষ রয় পাঞ্জাবের বিরুদ্ধে এই ম্যাচ জিততেই হবে ইস্ট বেঙ্গলকে যদি সুপার সিক্সে যাওয়ার আশা জিইয়ে রাখতে হয় কিন্তু নির্ভর করে থাকতে হবে নর্থ ইস্ট এবং চেন্নাইয়ের ম্যাচের দিকে তবে প্রেস কনফারেন্সে কিছুটা চিন্তিত দেখা গেল কোচ কার্লেস কোয়াদ্রাতকে কেননা কার্ড সমস্যার জন্য পাঞ্জাব ম্যাচে খেলতে পারছেন না মাছমাটের অন্যতম ভরসা সৌভিক চক্রবর্তী এবং অন্যতম ভরসাযোগ্য গোলরক্ষক প্রভসুকান গিল তাদের পরিবর্তন হিসেবে কোচ কাদেরকে বেছে নেবেন কামালজিৎ সিং নাকি আদিত্য পাত্র সেই নিয়েই কিছুটা চিন্তিত কোচ চলুন শুনে নেওয়া যাক এদিন প্রেস কনফারেন্সে কোচ কার্লেস কোয়াদ্রাত ঠিক কি বলছেন Last match of the regular season at home when we can celebrate 
with the supporters at the end of the game. Uh, Lisa and I, I belong to Barcelona. A lot of times the referee is doing shh, 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 and people walk and go, you know. And here people was waiting for the celebration, you know, and that's very nice. It means that they are happy, they want to celebrate, so I'm, I'm happy that we are in that process, that people again is uh, proud of the team and, and they are coming to the stadium and celebrating with us. I think it's very important, but it's only the first step in a, in a long way to try to bring the, the past glory to, to a big club like Ismail Khan. It's, it's difficult, it's difficult to, to get the mental connection to, to do that and also we always have uh, supporters in, in every place that we that we travel. There is always is one supporter because it's a big club eh, with a long history. So it means that always there is somebody supporting us. So it's it's going to be difficult. But I guess that because there is a high high uh, challenge for us to to win the playoff, uh, the motivation is going to be there, and I, I hope that we can not give it a lot of importance. And I have been watching the games and he, he is doing well, so I think that uh, it was a good opportunity now for the last three games of the season to, to have him in the list. I think that he is a player that uh, has chances to be the next season in the squad, so let's, let's keep working with him. And I want to make him play, uh, you know, uh, every game uh, has different demands. Until now it has not been possible and we were fighting in some situations that we don't need his help, but maybe tomorrow we need his help, so he's doing a, a good job. I think that uh, he understands my English quite well. You understand? Yes. And then he can understand my tactics. <laughs> Making tactics that has, has been putting us in the game. I mean, okay, we don't have that combination of uh, Midfielder, so we use my sometimes inside. We put the two central defenders. Sometimes we put Clayton uh, and Felicio together in attack. So you know you have players and you try to make uh, the tactical trying to work. And I'm happy that because what we have been doing eh, all the season now we arrive to the last game of the season with options to win the playoffs. So it means that okay we have been getting uh, the points that allowed us to be now in the fight. So, good enough. Uh, that kind of situation, Victor, so one injury, the other uh, taking time to get fit. We know that when we signed him. Uh, we know that uh, his last game was in November, so you take that risk. But these kind of things happen. And, uh, when you have three games in a row against teams that are fighting for the shield, uh, it's, it's, it's normal that the result is not uh, easy to get, no? so it was happening in the first half of the season eh, when we have to play go out eh, consecutive games and it happens again now that we have to play Mohuma and go out we know that our games that it's difficult to get points, we try our best, we, a lot of times we were, we were very close to get the result but eh, it's, it's not easy and a lot of times when you get the result then you are mentally stronger for the next game, you know, but uh, as far as we couldn't get results in, in, in the first game, then the second game becomes complicated. Football a lot of times is mental game, also physical game, you know, and we have been with that kind of calendar. We know that eh? every, every game after three, four days, and also, uh, you know, when you are in a dynamic that you are struggling with the results, playing with top teams, it's difficult to get something. But then we know we know our calendar that with Kevada, with Megaluru, there was options to, to get points and uh, luckily for us we get the 100% in, in these two games and now we have to, to try to beat uh, Punjab. Uh, there is positive things, negative things as always. The positive thing is that they don't play for the playoffs so they, they don't have that uh, eager or hunger that we have, but at the same time, uh, a lot of uh, times it means that they play more relaxed and they can enjoy the game and sometimes it's good for the players, sometimes it puts you in, in troubles 
because uh, when you play without pressure, sometimes you, you play even better. So that's it. I only hope that my, my player uh, show the, the consistency, uh, the physicality and the mental attitude to, to try to win the three points. And, uh, I'm, I'm happy in the last two games that we have been working all the season. Now we can see in the game that they know how to beat the important moments of the game, you know, to take good decisions for the team. So I hope that also it can help us in the last match. Let's see if it's possible. Yeah, it was the important plan. The plan was to 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 play with Saul during all the February, <laughs> but he was injured. And the plan was to put Victor in combination with Saul to to get something together because they are very good players. But unfortunately, this kind of things happen in football. So it's, it's not only one problem. Eh? Other teams, it's happening the same in all competition and in, in other leagues. So you as a coach have to try to eh, to, to make the situation working. And so not a lot of things that we can do in the pitch. We are going to do uh, video analysis tomorrow morning and, and before the game. And, yeah, let's hope that we can uh, fight for the three points because we have that very big motivation to be in the playoffs. So I'm sure that the players are going to give an extra effort to, to try to be there. Well, um, uh, Kamal City has been working very well during all the season, so now he has an opportunity and I'm sure that he's going to help us. No problem.